I want to share a little bit about some of the research we're presenting here at the American Heart Association meeting. This work was led by Dr. Safi Khan, who is affiliated with West Virginia University. Uh, we examined the enrollment of women into cardiology, cardiovascular clinical trials, specifically clinical trials that examined uh, lipid lowering therapies. And this is important because in 1986, the National Institutes of Health had uh, recommended inclusion of more women into clinical trials so that we can understand whether uh, drug therapy is as efficacious as women as it is in men. So we examined uh, trends from 19 1990 all the way to 2018 looking to see whether the enrollment of women in trials increased over this time and what we found is that the enrollment of women is still uh, disappointingly low on average only 31 uh, percent of trial participants were women uh, so that they're underrepresented in, 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 in th these trials and, and we also examined the representation in the trials compared to the women's disease prevalence in the population something called a participation to prevalence ratio and we found that was only about 0.5 meaning that uh, women are not only underrepresented in the trials they're underrepresented compared to their burden of disease in the population and so we hope that these findings bring this issue to light because if these results from these trials are being applied to make guidelines to make recommendations for treatment for both men and women we want to make sure that we uh, enroll enough women to make sure that these drugs work for them and are safe in them too.